How's it going YouTube? Brandon here with another episode of Pokemon Trading Card Game where this time we are going to be opening up 100 packs of XY Steam Siege. So let's go ahead and get into this. Um, go ahead and start some music over here. If y'all don't mind, just go ahead and get this started. Okay. Alright, now let's go ahead and get this started. Some cards that I'm definitely looking for out of this would definitely be Yon Mega and Yon Mega Break. That's what I'm definitely looking for out of this set. So let's get into this and see if we can get anything good. Hopefully this goes better than Evolutions. Evolutions was horrible. So we got a Hoppip, Dino, Dino, Driftbloom, Pokemon Ranger, nice. A Nido King Reverse Rare, nice. And a Toxicrow, Rare Rare. At least we start off with a Reverse Rare. <clears throat> excuse me. Allergies are kicking the day, so... You don't have to, have to excuse me, I got a lot of stuff up in me. <laughs> Mankey, Monkey. <laughs> Shellos, Tangela, Krogunk, Braviary, and an Evil Tall Hollow Rare. Nice. With the Blooming Wing and Darkness Play, that's definitely a playable card. Definitely take that. This is since I think the other one's out of rotation now, I believe. So Armor Fossil Shield on. Got a Cabalion, <clears throat> which is a reverse rare. And then Needle King regular rare. Okay. Is that is that Needle King any better than the one in Revolutions? The Needle Queen's not okay. If it's Needle Queen Power Lariat for each evolution Pokemon on your bench. Tempting. Times five eight. Okay, that would actually be pretty decent. Excuse me. Yeah, that would actually be pretty tempting to run. Seal our best up. Reverse Sea Dock and a Bi Sharp Hollow Rare. Nice. I definitely like in this series how they have like the dual types going on. It's actually a really cool idea. I wish they would have had another set. I believe this is the only set that does this. Flaffy, two Flaffy, one pack. And Avalug, regular rare. Nothing too good there. Go ahead and keep this rolling. Fletchling, Contra, Yanma. Oh, there's a Yanma. Um, and Bomb. What is that? A Hydrocon Break? Eh. Oh well. And a Clink Clang, Hall Rare. Nice. Definitely take that. Come on, open the packs. So, y'all having a good day? I know, I'm talking to the camera like y'all are actually. Like y'all can actually talk to me. Another Clink Clang. But, um. Yeah, I hope that y'all are having a good day. <laughs> Let's go ahead and keep this going. A Yanma Reverse, nice. And a Xerneas. Oh yeah, isn't um, Xerneas Break in here? I believe, I believe Xerneas Break is in here. It's actually a really good card too. Basiodon, Mantine, Nidorino, Greedy Dice. Meryl! I really need to work on that one. So Ashwat, Sneasel, what we get here? Talonflame, nice. Get um, with Gale Wings, definitely nice. If this Pokemon is in your hand when you're setting up to play, you may put it face down as your active Pokemon. Nice. Wait, search your deck for up to two cards and put them into your hand. Shuffle your deck afterward. That's actually pretty good. Another Xerneas, nice. That Talonflame, that Talonflame is definitely interesting to think about playing with because I think there's a Talonflame break in here as well. Even though a Talonflame break would be like, what, stage three? So it'd be pretty hefty, is it real? So I don't know, it might be too hefty of a uh, line to run in a deck. But it'd still be pretty cool. Two Grady Dice, one pack. Now Moongus. Oh, there's a Fungus, so I can say it. Fungus, a Moongus. <laughs> uh. Where's my water at? Sorry about the squeaky chair. It's really squeaky. Hear it? Squeak. <laughs> what we got? Dredigan. Nothing too good then. <clears throat> I'm gonna keep this rolling. Yarino. Come on. Hoopa. And a town flame. Regular rare. Okay, nice. Do do do, a palm, nice leaf, fungus, another evil tall, nice. 
We're starting around one of those dry spouts where we don't get any ultra rares again like we did in Evolutions. Yeah. Not good. That is a really cool Pyro art. It's a shame that it isn't a hollow. That, that is an awesome looking art. And I usually don't like Pyro. That is a cool looking art. Okay. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Samurai? Yeah, I forgot he's in here. Come on, we're superior. You gotta, you gotta give it a point. You gotta give me my grass type, man. I mean, Dagon um, Imbors had his time, and Dagon EX, and now Samurai. I mean, come on. Give me my Dagon superior. Dagon Ma. Gastrodon. Actually, this one I'll have to do my little magic trick where I exit out. Goodness gracious. Got plenty of Yanmas, which is nice. Is there an inch reverse? A Hoopa. It's actually, how many do I have of those uh, in total? We got three. Those would be tempting. I could probably trade those for a Yan Mega if I need to. But I want to try and see if we can get it. We got 80 more packs. Let's keep going. Let's keep it going. I'm just creeping you all out completely. <laughs> Captivating Pokepuff. Oh, there we go, finally, a Yon Mega. If you have exactly four cards in your hand, ignore all energy costs. I believe it... I forget, did it win or no? I think it plays really well in the senior division, I believe. Okay, thank you, Cloud called Klaus. I didn't need all that extra little rap stuff. Goodness. Still love your music though. <laughs> Alright, go ahead and open up another. Yanma. Ooh. Four retreat and five attack. Goodness gracious, three attach points with double colorists. This attack does 10 damage to each of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Hmm. Doesn't do enough bench damage, or else I'd be tempted to use it. If it did like 30, I'd be tempted to use it. But just doesn't do enough bench damage. Shift Tree Hollow, nice. Go ahead and keep going. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, so the thing I don't get is like, has a dark steel type or whatever. You know, the games, you know. A lot of Pokemon have dual types, and I don't understand why they don't just do that in this game more often. Steelix? Okay, uh, is it, it's a sign. It's a sign that it wants me to play as Mega Steelix. I might be able to get something to run. I don't know. I'll have to fool around with that a little. No guarantee on that one, though. Infernape, nice. Ponyta, Mankey, Shellos. I know, in I know you hate these, and so do I, so you're not alone. <laughs> Shiftry! Hopip, Chimchar, Bocorona. Ah, uh, come on. Ninja Boy, nice. Armado. And a Volcano EX. Finally, something good. Something playable out of the Ultra Rare spot. Definitely take that. Come on, I just want to make a break. Come on, give me something here. It can't be that hard, right? To get that? Come on, goodness gracious, Narfungus, Needle King. Oh, come on, Yan Mega. Break. It definitely looks like I'm going to have to be trading for those, definitely. But, oh well. Quite a few cards in my collection that I really don't want. 
Especially on, uh, well, PTCG, I was gonna say in real life, but, you know. Finally, a Yamega break. But yeah, if I don't get a full playset, or at least three, I think it's what I'm going to run, I think it's three of those. I think. Anyway, nice. Glad I got that. Go ahead and mark that. Needle King, goodness gracious, get out of here. Needle King just wants to be a part of everything, doesn't he? A ball again, and an Infernape again. Come on. I saw that Halucha just now. Please in if you're watching this. I doubt you are, but if you are, please rip it. Just rip all the Haluchas that you find. I don't even care if it's the Halucha EX that disgracefully came about. Oh, I so totally just want that. Calm down, camera. Calm down. I just... Definitely like my least favorite Gen 6. Gosh. There's usually one in each generation that I absolutely just hate. And that's definitely that one. <laughs> Shift to reverse and throw it again. Just rip it. Did we get a fungus? Ah, oh, we didn't get the fungus. Yanma, let me go. Arvesta. And a primate. That evolved from a monkey. Thank you. Fungus. Are we gonna get an Amoongus? Ah, oh, we didn't get a Amoongus. But we did get two Dragon with back. That's one thing, though, that I that I really wish they print reprint again is that on double dragon energy. It made dragon Pokemon so much more viable to play. Because right now with double dragon energy not being in rotation, it as of right now, as of when I'm recording this of July, <laughs> um, they don't have a double dragon energy, which is a shame. It's one of my favorite decks for last rotation that was before actually two rotations ago was the Noivern from I believe it was Furious Fist with the Echo Location and Boom Burst I think it was and then pairing up the uh, Noivern Break from Breakthrough on top that's a nice card to get that was one of my favorite combos to use <clears throat> because Boom Burst could do the 30 I believe it's 30 across the whole entire bench then you use Judge to make your cards even, and then you could hit your opponent for 150. And so it was just one of my best decks I had. <sighs> Shame that the Noivern that you can currently use with um, Noivern Break isn't as good, though, because it doesn't have Echo Location. Nice, John Mega. For those who don't know, the Noivern from the Fierce Fist, whatever, with Echo Location, basically, if your opponent attacked you, nice. If your opponent attacked you, um, you could flip a coin. If heads, you prevent all damage done to that Pokemon. Which was so nice. And then you paired that up with... Um, could you pair that up? I can't remember. Maybe you couldn't pair it up with Trick Coin. I don't remember. But yeah, that was just an... Even without Trick Coin, whatever. It was a fun deck to play because you could really just wall out some huge Pokemon that were very dangerous. Such as like Mega Mewtwo Y and stuff, you could just like block that from ever attacking you. Which was so much fun. Ooh, 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 ooh nice. Nice, nice, nice. I really want this card in real life. And because I love the emerald green in the background. I just love the artwork. So anyway, there hasn't been a Pokemon Ranger game in a long time, has it? I don't believe so. I think the last time was on the Raider DS, I think. I think possibly. I can't really remember. It's been so long ago. <laughs> Come on, at least give me another... Ooh, Gardevoir. Nice. I forgot about Mega Gardevoir as well. Come on, at least give me... Um, Another Yon Mega Break. I mean, come on. At least one more. 
And Barros. That's a cute little artwork. Because he's acting like his tail's like the black house with the little guy there. Or normally that's the lighthouse. Yeah. No, that's a, that's a shooting star. He's the lighthouse. Yeah. Still, anyway, cute artwork. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Okay, by Sharp. What we got here? Oh, Elite Four for Oraz. Nice. Okay. Armaldo. Come on, goodness gracious. Another Pyroar. And a Spear Tomb. I wish Spear Tomb was more playable. Definitely cool Pokemon. Pokorona. Dun, dun. Right, so I got three of those. Do I have any reverses? Don't think I do. Do I? I got two regulars. I think I got out of a theme deck somewhere. Can't really remember. But the thing is about this Young Mega Break deck, however. One card I'm really waiting for doesn't even come out until um, Burning Shadows. Which, as of right now, Burning Shadows is not out yet in English. So, yeah. I'm really looking forward to that. Um, another mega. It's just a sign. I tell you, it's just a sign. Is uh, that Alola Ninetales? Not, not the full art junk that's in um, Guardians Rising. But the one that comes out in Burning Shadows that has the uh, super safeguard or something like that. Ultra Light Safeguard or whatever. Basically prevents all damage of um, GX and EX. It is a stage one, but I will definitely be at least running probably a 2-2 two -two line of that, definitely. Go ahead and go through here. Bastio Don. Alright. Ponyard, Jotic, Azumarill. Ooh, there we go. Talonflame Break. Yeah, I know. Discard all fire energy attached to this Pokemon. Wouldn't be too bad. Excuse me. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Um, I want to check that out real quick. Got 34 more packs. I want to check this energy. So I think this is still legal, right? This card can only be attached to fire type Pokemon. Do, 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 do. This card is discarded by an attack of the Pokemon this card is attached to. Attach this card from Discord card them. Yeah, I'll be tempted to run that with that, definitely. Alright. 34 more packs to go. Basically, two thirds of the way through. So, hopefully, we can get another Yon make a break. That's all I'm really looking for. That's all I really want. Another Ball Canyon. Got three of those. No secret rare though. It's kind of weird. The only set that was like really nice to me was secret rares was um breakthrough. Like goodness gracious, good night. I got like I have like a hundred packs of that. I know it was before I had this channel, but I got like I believe like three or four secret rare Mewtwo's. I was like, what's the heck's going on? <laughs> Um, anything? Shiftry? Fungus? No fungus? Okay. Darn it, no fungus. Do do do. Alright, Dredagon. I'm actually pretty pleased with what I've gotten so far, though. I can't hate on it. Very pleased with what I've gotten, especially with the Pokemon Ranger. say 10. Hmm. Might look that up afterwards. Ooh, make a card for. With the Despair Ray. Discard as many of your bench Pokemon as you like. This attack does 10 more damage for each bench Pokemon you discard in this way. So if you had 5, you would discard and get 160 for 2 energy. Actually, no. I just thought of a dangerous combo. I don't know. I don't know if I've seen it yet or not. The um, I know this. I'm gonna be done here in a second. But this is one I want to look up real quick. Uh, 
what is it? Flow. At, uh, what is the name of that Pokemon? I don't remember what that Pokemon is. What is it? There we go. Florges. Goodness gracious, what can I think of that? Anyway, each of your uh, Pokemon's attack costs one fairy less. So if you ran that with that um, Gardevoir, Mega Gardevoir, it would do at least 110 for one energy. That is pretty brutal. That is pretty stinking brutal. I know it's a Mega, so that's kind of a little bit more difficult to get up and running, especially with like Field Blower and Junk running around now, but um, it's tempting. Ooh, yeah, I make it nice. So, I mean, if I can't get the break, I'll just. I'll try to look for one. Trade for it or whatever. So I really want it. But you know, you can't always get what you want. You can't always get what you want. <laughs> okay, keep going. Um, another thing I'm also interested in doing for this channel, too. Um, I don't know by this time, I'm kind of recording this in the past, so I don't know if I'll be doing it by then, but I'd like to try and play a little bit of Overwatch, honestly. I have it, and I'm good at Fungus Among Us. I'm not very good at it, but I did kind of upgrade, though. Instead of using the Goofy controller, I got myself this guy. Let's see if I can show it on camera. Without breaking, let's see if I can, are you there? Come on. Come on. There we go. He's just kind of showing through. Anyway, that numpad thing there. And honestly, I'm going to open up another while I'm fixing stuff. Um, honestly, that makes a world of difference for me because I hate using, um, I hate using, um, keyboards. It's just my flavor. I just don't like using keyboards as much. But this right here, I can actually use this. And I like it. Don't know how loud it'll be. It'll be. I know it is a mechanical, so it might be kind of loud. Magirna, nice. So I'll have to think about that. Because I don't know, that might be too loud. But yeah, i definitely uh, change that so it'll make it a lot easier to play. But anyway, back to Pokemon. We've got Clef Key, and a Yon Mega Reverse. And Ampharos. We just got one Yon Mega Break. It's kind of saddening. At least one and one more. Come on, give me something. Give me the magic. Nidorino, Flaffy, Bocarona. Do 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 do. Ah, da 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 da. Alright. Dredigan. Nothing too amazing. Kind of tempted to run that um, Mega Steely style. Another Guard of War, nice. Just because I have, what, two of them, I think, now? Be tempted to play with. Another Magirna, nice. Prevent all effects of your opponent's attacks except damage done to each of your Pokemon that has any Steel Energy attached. Nice. That'd be a nice tech to throw in a steel deck. Um, uh, one combo I've seen with that recently has definitely been the um, excuse me, Sogaleo, Magirna, and um, Metagross. Goodness gracious, the Metagross with the Geotech systems or whatever. I've seen that combo running, and it seems to work pretty decently an interesting deck to try out. I'm just not a big steel deck person. It's just not... Ooh, I forgot all about you. I forgot all about you. I will definitely take that. I will 100% take that. <laughs> That was pretty awesome. Talon Flame again. Yeah, some of the break cards are the ones I'm really looking for. Seems like. Another Gardevoir. Gardevoir is just running rampant around here. 
going and keep going. We got Xerneas and a Volcarona. I think we're down to the final five, aren't we? Uh, uh, final five, aren't we? If I could talk. So final five packs. Here we go. Hopefully we can get something amazing out here. That Sycamore was amazing, though. So I think that's going to be kind of hard to top. But you know what? We'll keep trying. Yon again. Qualitzer break. What do you do? The defending Pokemon can't retreat during your opponent's next turn. To your next turn, any damage done to that Pokemon by attacks is increased by 120. Hmm. I could see something going on with that. Especially now with the Dagon GXs with their HP being as high as they are. Another Pokemon Ranger, goodness gracious. Got three of those now, don't I? Yeah, three. I don't know of any deck that really use those, so more than like one or two. Ooh, Magirna. Definitely take that. But yeah, since Magirna's only really a tech, I may trade the regular art for a for a break that I need. We end off on a Gastron, um, uh, two Gastron, one pack. But definitely, definitely go ahead and type that in. That's Sycamore. That would definitely be the highlight of this opening for me, anyway. That will definitely see play in my decks on here, for sure. So, anyway, um, yeah, this was actually a lot better than the um, Evolutions. So much better than the Evolutions opening. So, um, yeah. I know I'm just staring into your soul. I'm just going to slowly get closer and closer. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm kidding. Anyway, I want to thank you all for watching. Hope that you all have a great rest of the day. And I will see you all in the next one. But for right now, this is Brandon signing off. See you later.